This is uh, from last week. Apologize for not getting back sooner, but if you look at Harry's back and where the ball position is, it's like pretty far back in the like at least center of his stance. If you look at the point between his shoulder blades here, it's in front of the ball. I was trying to give him the idea of to get his chest more over the center of his right foot. I don't really want long term to have too much sway off the ball, but I think that his leg going out in this direction, especially his knee, it causes his upper back to go in the opposite direction toward the target. So he gets into a little bit of a reverse situation. He goes farther forward. At some point he'll have to back out to be able to get to the ball. He'll hit the ball pretty low and his hands are pretty far back. So that causes some uh, issues coming into the ball. So we, Later we worked on, now this is, I know this is a wood, so it's not apples and apples, but um, still pivoting, trying to get his his body to upper body to go back more to the right. So he has the, the intention of getting his chest more over his knee, which he comes closer to here. Right there. And he's still leaning some, his upper back is leaning this way, but it's just a little bit nearer even with the ball. So Long term, my objective is to get him to understand how to make his body work in such a way that he doesn't have quite so much back bend. Back's kind of arching toward the target. And that will allow him to post up better on his back leg to push off of and also elevate the ball. So this is going to cause a little bit more of a hitting down on the ball and also like a lower ball flight. We want to hit a little bit more up on a driver and have a higher ball flight.